With the increasing use of digital media, the days of DVD video are slowly fading away. There has never been a better time to get those DVDs transferred or ripped to your computer or media center for instant playback. There are many ways of doing this and here we have one of the simplest software solutions for the Mac platform. Developed by Digiati Software, it currently stands as one of the fastest, easiest and best DVD rippers out there. Welcome to IFTI's Tech Corner, where today we'll be taking a closer look at Mac X DVD Ripper Pro. Let's get all the legal stuff out of the way first. Remember, you must be the legal owner of any DVDs you wish to rip into a digital format. Any ripping of DVDs should be for backup purposes only. Mac X DVD Ripper Pro is really user friendly once you get the hang of it. As soon as you open the software, you'll find instructions right on the user interface on how to use it. The actual user interface itself is very clean and simple, nothing too complicated. Great for beginners as well as having those extra options for more advanced users. However, there are so many conversion options in the app that it can get confusing for some users. Don't be intimidated though, once you've played around with the application, you'll love having so many tools at your disposal. You'll literally have tons of conversion options, so you can pretty much convert into almost any format for a wide range of devices. It's not just limited to Apple iDevices. You start off by selecting what you want to rip from the top corner here, the actual DVD disc, which is probably the option you'll choose most often, an ISO image or a folder containing DVD content. From there you can choose from a huge variety of output format profiles. Some profiles include a DVD backup, Apple devices, Android devices and even Microsoft devices. Mac X DVD Ripper Pro definitely stands out when it allows you to convert the DVD to almost whatever format you want. So if I was to rip a DVD movie for example, I simply load a DVD into the Mac and then click the DVD disc button to select the disc. Then choose one of the main tabs to select how you want to convert the movie. If you want to put the movie onto your iPod, you choose to iPod, which will pull up the general iPod video settings. Select the profile setting for your iPod, which sets the video format, video frame size, quality and audio settings. The default iPod settings are pretty good, but what's really nice is the ability to manually adjust how the software will convert the audio and video. Once you've chosen your output format, you can customize your output file a bit more by clicking on the edit button next to the selected title. A new window will appear that will give you options to trim, crop or add subtitles to your output file. Again, Mac X DVD Ripper Pro has definitely nailed it by using variety as a necessity. As soon as you have all that set up, you're almost ready to begin ripping. Just before you do, you have these other options near the run button that you can decide from. They're the high quality engine, deinterlacing, safe mode and CPU core use. The high quality engine basically preserves the converted output file in its best quality possible. Deinterlacing helps improve the quality of the output file. There may be some added time to the conversion though if you have any of these two options selected, but even then it's only by a couple of minutes for an hour and a half movie. I highly recommend trying out these features because they really do work out great. If you are running into any issues, that's where safe mode comes in. Safe mode is basically a smooth conversion process where it avoids any errors during the conversion. This is only recommended if you run into any issues while ripping the DVD. If all these options slow down the conversion process a bit, you can select multiple CPU cores to increase the speed. The speed in which it will rip and convert the DVD depends on several factors, including the length of the video or movie, the video format and conversion settings selected, the number of CPU processors selected and even the max specs such as processor speed and RAM. Also note that if the DVD you legally purchased and own has the latest encryption, MacX DVD Ripper Pro updates will be able to decrypt and rip the disk. There are a number of help and support options for the software through its parent company, Digiati Software. These include email contact, an extensive FAQs page, in-depth tutorials and a user guide. Plus, as mentioned earlier, once you open MacX DVD Ripper Pro, there are basic instructions on what to do. It's really pretty self-explanatory. MacX DVD Ripper Pro is a great DVD ripper and converter for the Mac platform and it works fast while maintaining a high level of quality. Both beginners and advanced users can work with the default conversion settings which are fully customizable. 
The broad range of supported devices is also a fantastic feature and this definitely stands as one of the fastest, easiest and best DVD rippers out there. Feel free to leave your thoughts and comments below. In the meantime, why not check out my channel for any related videos and click the logo above to subscribe and be informed of when my next video is released. See you next time on Ifty's Tech Corner.